Hey guys, Nathan here, and today we're going to be reacting to some old photos. So before I get this started, I just want to say thank you for those that have supported my channel, even though I just kind of do it to make videos for fun and just to try and educate whoever finds the videos. It's not really about subscribers or anything, but I managed to get to 500, which doesn't seem like much to most people, but it's quite a lot to me. So thank you if you uh, subscribe to me. So that's that. We will move on to reacting to some old photos. I've found some. I've got a folder of old photos, but they're often either with someone else or there's not really many because I didn't really like being in photos. So I started picking some out, but I thought it might be better to just go through them all and pick them out as I go so I remember which photos I've looked at. So first one I found was this one. I don't know why I had such a thing for Spider-Man specifically when I was younger. Like, I don't really remember watching Spider-Man things that much or anything. And I am petrified of spiders. Like, I shit you not, if I see a spider, I will run. So I find that quite funny that I seem to like Spider-Man when I was younger because me and spiders are just really don't mix. <laughs> Very low quality. But like, the way that my hair is in these, this isn't that old, this is like a couple of years old, these aren't old, old photos. But the way that my hair looks in these is just... Is, got me as a, a Dalmatian. You can tell in one of them that I've clearly rubbed it off my nose, because I am hopeless. Like, I never, I never look impressed in any of these photos really, when I'm like a preteen. I'm just like get me out of here. So this is a photo when my hair is out and which is very weird because I would never have my hair down or straightened or anything. So that's what my hair looks like regularly. I've got a lot of photos. I didn't even realize how many photos I have. Like I'm not even a fifth of the way. Point at some footprints as a small child. My hair is just crazy. My god. When I was younger I did dancing which was it's like, I like the dance part of it, but I didn't like the dressing up or going on stage. That's what I absolutely hated about it. But this is a photo from that era. Another costume. This time, a clown. Because why not? What, this is one of my favourite photos. So I'm just lying on the couch and watching TV. So then the corner, there's the fridge. And I'm just like absolutely stuffing my face. I don't even know what it is. There's me with the doggo, Zoe. Still have Zoe, she's 10. So this is her when she was a little pup and she's so cute. And I'm just squinting for dear life because there's a flash on the camera. Now this is a good example of my like everyday outfit in this era. So I'd have a snapback. I used to wear like just hats all the time. Specifically this green hat, I would wear it all the time. I still have it. And then I would wear, I think I had like three of these blue gander shirts, but like gander shirts with the ship shorts and then just slip on shoes from Kmart. Also, I think I've got like anklets on there. But yeah, this was my look. This was, this was me in my prime. This is, this is what I looked like for a very long time. This is me with Zoe when she was a bit older. Again, another gander shirt. I have my hair out though, so that's a bit different. I think this one was from like a fishing club breakup thing and dad took a kayak to the res, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I don't really look very impressed with whoever's taking the photo. <laughs> okay, now this, this is... <laughs> uh, this, there's so many things wrong with this photo. <laughs> like, what is that? Oh my god. Oh my god. Now that's a photo. Like, I tried to, like, have, like, a side fringe thing as well, and it just didn't really work. It was just like, what is this hand? Why is it there? And, like, I look so lanky and long, and oh no. I was also in the Girl Guides group. It's like, I didn't really want to be in it very much, but I went on a trip to Tassie, which was a bit of a flop for me personally. I did not enjoy it. Um, but this was me going and also still have a side fringe and that's not very appealing at all. 
And here's one with straightened hair. Now that, again, not impressed. I just, I'm sorry. I just really don't like getting photos taken of me. I've got so much better in the past, like, two years or so. I've done a lot better, but like back then I just hated getting my photo taken. And this is a good series of photos, oh my god. So I've got two greyfish and seem to be trying to make them attack each other. I don't know why I look like that. And I've got like the maddest sunburn on my foot, Jesus Christ. Why do I look like that? Also button shirts very much were a thing. I just looked... Uh, I just lived, like, in a stereotype. You know exactly what I'm talking about when you see any of these photos. You just know. Oh god, okay. So this was something that I was absolutely dreading. Was my... Year... 11... Um... Dinner thing we had. So... I don't really have much of a choice in wearing a dress. So I went for just... Straight up black, which is fine, but I just look, it's just, I just look so wrong. It doesn't, it's not, yeah, my hair's straightened and like flipped over and it just doesn't look like me. Does it look like me? <laughs> like really, does this, one thing that I did do with guides was one of the, I think it was the centenary year for Anzac day um, two soldiers that go on the corners of the memorial they couldn't make it that day so they asked for um, members of scouts and guides to put someone up to do that so I volunteered as tribute and went up and stood there for a little while as still as I possibly could but that was a really cool opportunity and something that was interesting to experience having done, especially on the centenary. Oh, Now, we have the drastic haircut. So my long hair to short hair. So this is what my hair used to look like. Mid-brown and a bit of an ombre, bit frizzy, bit wavy, kinda dead. And then it went into this cut, which is really looks like the carrot. It's like a spinning image of the Karen haircut. Is this not exactly it? It's just the most terrible thing I've ever seen. Oh my god. It's like even down to like this bit here, how it's just like a little point, like everything is just wrong. And like when I left there was like all the, like like middle-aged people who were like, oh yeah, it's so good. It's like, I'm just like, uh, because I wanted to get an undercut first, but then they convinced me to like go a little bit longer to start off with. Which I really shouldn't have done, I should have just stuck with what I wanted. And then I ended up just, just, ugh, just hating it. So I just turned it into like a Justin Bieber haircut basically when I styled it myself. So it wasn't that bad once I styled it the way I wanted to, but it was still pretty bad. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I want to put that in there. Oh god. Oh no. These are just bad. That's just a bad photo. <laughs> well, I guess I have to put it in now that I've s said something about it. Oh my god, what is that? Like, my legs? What is that leg? I've got a lot of leg. I just don't look very pro proportionate at all. <laughs> For some reason I really like this photo where I'm like fucking giving the tiger a bit of a... What do you call it? Putting him in a headlock. Yeah. It looks, the tiger looks very distressed. This is what also one of my, so this photo is also one of my favorite photos that I have, that's an old photo. So basically what was happening, I think there's like, maybe a Christmas or something, I don't know. I was just standing and talking and then someone said there was a spider on me and tricked me out and I'm just freaking out and then they go and whack me with this thing. So that is like the perfect shot of that emotion that I had. It was just pure fear. Going to... what is it? Dream World? Sneaking my head over there like... that's my little face. There's a thing where I'm feeding some birds and I got attacked and it jumped all over me. I was like, shit! Me as a pirate? Hell yeah. I support that. There's a cave in this mountain near where my grand and pa are. And so that's me in the cave, or in part of the cave, the front part. 
interesting. Got some plats going on there. Hey, I got a fish. Hell yeah. I am grinning. Jesus Christ. Why am I holding the fish like that? I'm just like, like, with this fish. <laughs> it's just like, eh. Also got my tiger's beanie on. Richmond fan. Ooh, I was a knife. That sounds a bit weird, but I was a knife. It was in Beauty and the Beast. Do you remember when ripsticks were a thing? I still have my ripstick. This is me falling off it. How did I even manage to do that? Isn't that the back end that I'm falling off of? I'm not really sure what's going on in that. It doesn't even look like I'm opening my eyes. <laughs> oh my god, what is that? Oh no, I look like a, a blobfish and being buried. And then there's me with a tuna. Uh, I did not catch the tuna. I don't go tuna fishing because it's, well, further out than, than I would like to go. Hell yeah. Chillin' with my snowman. It's like, I've never watched the Titanic, but is it paint me like one of your French girls? Is that, is that what the phrase? That's basically me right now. Ooh, this is my graduation. So I wore a suit. I look so much happier in this suit than I was the previous in that dress. That, that is a much happier person. Ooh, look at this for a Justin Bieber haircut. My God. <laughs> so I've clearly like just combed it. So I tried to make my hair into like a mohawk or something. I kind of look like Jimmy Neutron, but with like hoop earrings and just, yeah, that's a great photo. <laughs> Lots of pictures of the cat. Should I show you a picture of the cat? This is a great picture of the cat. I'm just gonna put this in because I like my cat. And she's cute. And she looks like she wants to kill me. <laughs> so this is when I got my wisdom teeth out. And that's me trying to smile. That's the best I could do after getting them out. I think that's basically all I can find other than if I looked at stuff within the past couple of years. But that's kind of not really the point because they're not that old. So that is all of my photos that I wanted to show you and react to. There's quite a few funny ones. They're mostly funny ones to be honest. But that was me and me growing up. So I hope you enjoyed me looking back at some old photos. Uh, if you have any more suggestions for me let me know. Thank you for getting me to 500 subs. That means a hell of a lot and I didn't think that I would get to that because I just do this for fun really. But if you do want to support me Leave a like and subscribe if you want, and with that I will see you later.